Hi, I'm Mary Blackman, founder of Farm Star Living, and we're talking flowers. One of my most favorite things, and that feels like spring to me. So we're working with a fantastic company that's been the flower experts for 100 years, Ball Horticultural Company. They're out of Chicago, they were founded by Mr. George Ball, and they're a family-owned business. We couldn't be more thrilled. So let me give you a few little tips for making arrangements in your home. First of all, think of it as primary flowers, secondary flowers, fillers, and greens. And the combination of all of those will make something very creative and artistic, okay? And this is when you start putting your own personality into it. Personally, we think that roses or sunflowers, something kind of substantial should be your primary flower. Then you have beautiful secondary flowers. Some of them, oh God, they're so gorgeous here. We have the Rose of the South, which I'll show you in a second. And then we have beautiful fillers like the Wave, that reminds me of being at a farmer's market. And then we have fillers like the fabulous new one in fashion. It's like, they're calling it the cloud. Okay, so this looks like baby's breath, but I got news for you. This is actually Marabella. It is a better, newer variety, and you have to ask for it by name. But why is it better? Because actually, they're whiter, which is really nice for your bouquet or arrangement, and it doesn't tangle, and they're really like round and, I don't know, cloud-like. So if you're using this for your arrangement or a bouquet, whatever it might be, your primary flowers will really pop and it'll set them apart. And they're just so beautiful, light and airy. I love it. See these little babies? Love them. First of all, they're called the Rose of the South. So why wouldn't I love them? Actually, that's what their nickname is, but their true name is called Lysanthius. And let me tell you a little bit about it. First of all, these beautiful flowers keep opening. This one actually has like a double rosebud in here and it just keeps blooming and they're absolutely gorgeous. It adds a touch of class, a little bit of elegance to any arrangement and I just love them. It comes in a lot of different colors so you can pick your favorite color type and then put these in your flowers. I'm telling you, it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, one thing to know is that California and Holland are the main growers of this because it's really difficult to grow. So it's a real specialty flower and Ball has been creating them and sent us these lovely varieties and I am hooked. I think out of the pink and the purple, I love the pink. It's just so pretty. I don't know, makes me feel like, like spring. I love these. This is the Dianthus flower. It was perfected by the Ball Horticulture Company over the last eight years. So now, the Dianthus has a very long vase life, has a fabulously strong stem, and they're self-cleaning. I know, sounds crazy, right? But the small flower is absolutely absorbed when it dies by the plant. So there are no more little dead flowers in your water. It's perfect. So this one is actually the Diantha Sweet, which comes from the Sweet William family. Comes in a variety of colors. We have coral, we have this beautiful burgundy, just so many beautiful colors, and I love them. So I really think that these make a fabulous, fabulous secondary flower in your bouquets. Last but not least, don't forget your greens. That's right, you gotta have the greens, just like you do in your diet. You gotta have greens to set your arrangement off in a beautiful way, and so many great greens to choose from. So thank you, Ball Horticulture Company, for doing the great work that you do and bringing all these fantastic flowers fresh from the farm. We couldn't be more thrilled, and we think we all deserve a little color in our lives. Thank you so much. See you in a flower field.